Gus Zabo, also known as Zabotage, is a Hong Kong-based artist. The lucky cat for me is just so Hong Kong. But when the artist, along with his wife and business partner, Hannah Zabo, were told about NFTs by a longtime collector friend, they thought, why not give it a try? He basically just explained it all to us and how kind of it was really taking off. And we just kind of thought, wow, this really sounds interesting. Yeah. Now Zabotage has a new canvas digitally designing works and transforming them into non-fungible tokens. I, I see the potential there of, you know, writing history uh, with, 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 you know, where it's, it's reaching the highest prices at Christie's for a, an NFT being sold or, um, you know, just coming up with something revolutionary to NFTs. You know, there, there, there's so much opportunity there on the playing field, so uh, I, I'm ready to explore it even further. Exploring it further while creating new business opportunities, like his traditional canvas works, a Zabotage NFT will tell a story and be sold for a price. If you can get some sort of emotion from uh, a physical piece of artwork or an NFT uh, piece of artwork, digital artwork, um, then, then that's worth its weight. It's, it's, it's how much value you see in that. The real value may not be in the actual artwork though, rather in the token that connects your name with the artist's work on the blockchain. NFTs are not the art. Right. NFTs are the certificate of authenticity of that piece. Valentina Lafredo is a visual artist who has been based in Hong Kong for 15 years. Lafredo's works consist mostly of photography, but she's been experimenting with other media. She first learned of NFTs on the popular social media app Clubhouse. The part about like blockchain was very uh, fascinating, really exciting to kind of experience this moment where there is this disruptive technology that can change the world. Her knowledge on the subject grew, and soon after she began experimenting with the technology. For me it's a technology that gives authenticity, gives provenance, gives transparency to digital art which changed the game completely for digital art. For Forecast News, I'm Lucas Caccioli, Hong Kong.